Hey, how's it going? Uh, this is Flip Trick, and this is the first segment of my gaming news show that I'm starting. Um, basically, I'm just going to sum up everything that I found that was interesting today in the, the gaming industry and throw it all together in a three to five minute video. We're going to get right into the console re releases for this week. Um, it's a pretty big week, the final week of the holiday season. After this, there isn't really much coming out for the rest of the year. Um, but this week we do have a pretty extensive list, so I'll go through it real quick. Uh, we have Saints Row the Third, Assassin's Creed Revelations, Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3, Need for Speed The Run, DreamWorks Superstar Carts, I'm not sure what that one is, uh, Jurassic Park The Game, L.A. Noir: The Complete Edition, which I'm pretty sure is just a re-release of L.A. Noir with all the DLC packs combined, um, Marvel Super Superhero Squad Comic Combat, and Rayman Origins. And PS3 exclusive is Dynasty Warrior 7 and iPad and Friends. Xbox 360 exclusive is Halo Combat Evolved Anniversary Edition. And Wii exclusive on November 20th is The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. So it might finally be time to dust off those Wiis and have a real game for that system. Uh, I haven't played my Wii in over a year, so it's going to be weird going back to the nunchuck and playing Zelda again. Um, definitely looks to be like a good game, probably be the final hurrah for the Wii, um, but it looks like it's going to go out in style because this game looks to be very, very good. Aside from just gaming news, uh, Dead Island finally announced a release date for the Bloodbath Arena. Um, they, uh, it was supposed to come out relatively soon when the game released, uh, but they had to polish the game a bit and that got delayed. It will be, it has been confirmed for November 22nd. Um, so don't trade those games in just yet. Um, at least check out the Bloodbath Arena and see if it's worth holding on to. For PS3, Gran Turismo 6 is in the works. Uh, they finally announced that that will be uh, that is on the way. There's no official release date yet, but it is on its way. For the 360, Halo 4, um, they said Halo 4 will be on the, the 360. There's been a lot of speculation on whether or not it will be on the 360 or this new upcoming console, since they're both supposed to be coming out around the same time. Um, but... 343 has confirmed that it will be on the 360. The Black Friday ads have been released. Uh, there's a ton of good deals out there. Um, Toys R Us, for example, has buy one, get one for $5 on quite a few games. Uh, Need for Speed, the run is on this list. Rage, uh, Battlefield 3. Uh, Walmart has new releases for $28, so a little bit better. Uh, they have Arkham City, ba Battlefield 3, Madden 12, FIFA 12. Forza 4, uh, Infamous 2 is on that list, um, and oh, Assassin's Creed Revelations is at Best Buy for $35, so you might want to hold off on picking it up on Tuesday, maybe wait a week if you can. Uh, there's a ton of other games coming out, so it's not like there won't be anything to play while you're waiting. Um, I was planning on picking it up, I think I'm probably going to wait. Um, but also at Best Buy, aside from Assassin's Creed, uh, they have three-month Xbox Live subscriptions for $8. As far as the big console bundles, the PS3 uh, is $199. It comes with the system, 120 gig hard drive, Ratchet and Clank, all for one, Little Big Planet 2, and a controller. I was just saying recently I need to pick up a PS3. I want both those games, so this might actually be something I'm going to be purchasing. The 360, the best deal on that seems to be the $299 bundle. It comes with the system, the controller, the 250 gig hard drive, Three months of Xbox Live, Halo Reach, Fable 3, and the Wii. They just released a new uh, black Wii. Um, the, that bundle is $149. comes with a black system, the black controller, uh, new Super Mario Brothers, and the Super Mario Galaxy soundtrack. Links to all the ads in the description below. Be sure to check those out. Um, I only have the ads for the, the United States. I don't have... I don't know how... I don't even know if you guys have Black Friday over in Europe and Australia, but... Um, for my United States viewers, uh, all those ads will be down there below for you, so be sure to check those out, and let me know what you guys are planning on buying. Uh, but that wraps up everything I have for you today. Uh, hopefully this you found this informative. Uh, be sure to like the video if you have, and be sure to subscribe. I'm probably be doing this Monday through Friday. Could end up being Monday, Wednesday, Friday, based on how much information I actually find out there, uh, but be sure to ch check back and keep watching.